For my 26th birthday, I made a short vlog about all the things I did that day. And I started by blaring Kanye West, We Don't Care Because. We weren't supposed to make it past 25. Jokes on you, we still alive. Now, here I am an entire year later. Another year of life lived. Another year with my best friend. Another revolution around the sun. Another 365 days. So what did I learn from 26? First of all, it's not like being 25. It's completely different and anyone who tells you anything otherwise is lying. You realize you're a lot closer to 30 than you wanna be and you really start to reminisce on being 18 and fresh out of college. But you also realize that it's disrespectful for people to treat you like a child. You start to take pride and ownership of your life and that's a very beautiful thing. You, me, have excelled in your career. You've come a long way from that skinny kid who only posted on Facebook. Now, you're a coordinator at a credit union and you still post on Facebook, but your job is way more than that. You've been married for an entire year. What? You, the kid who prayed and wished for a woman to spend your life with? You have her and she's amazing, better than anything you could have ever dreamed. You and your wife bought a house. You actually bought a house in Louisiana. Your younger self is writhing in pain, but you're actually pretty happy about it. You're still a workaholic and you have so many hobbies, but you're getting better at time management and you're getting better at your craft. Your photos are way better than they were even a few months ago. Keep doing that. You like it a lot. You've started taking care of your body I mean really taking care of it, and I'm proud of you for that. It's taken a lot of work and it has not been easy, but you're doing it. You don't really watch a lot of TV and movies, but you listen to audiobooks. You've started to gain another appreciation for allowing your brain to relax. It's good for you. Do more of that. Your wife has helped you understand the true value that family has. Cherish them. Appreciate them love them. Their days, like yours, are not promised. 26 has not been without the bad. Friends have confided in you. You've been broke. Heroes have passed on. The world entered a pandemic and almost took your joy with it. You struggled with your identity over and over again. But you made it. No one talks about how much you really find yourself after you turn 25. No one really shows these years the appreciation and love they deserve. So as you move into 27, love yourself. Truly, love yourself. Just because 27 isn't one of those highlight years for everyone else, doesn't mean it can't be one for you. Live your life your way. And remember that you can do anything you put your mind to. Believe that.